And could you imagine that somebody from Russia came to Great Britain and take your child from your family? Because they believe that it's their own children. And take to Russia state and uh, tell your child that your parents no need you, your country is very bad, and you are trying to go to Russia and just to find and take your child back. And somebody stop you in Moscow in the airport. You fly in there and tell why you're going there. Because my child is there. Why you? What do you want to do with your child? I want to take my child back. Why? Because it is a war in Ukraine. It's the against child's rights. It's not good. It's a danger. You want to take your child to a danger. Uh, no, I want to take my child home. No, it's better if you stay in Russia. We can help you. We can give you financial support. But first, you have to receive Russian citizenship. But I don't want to be a Russian citizen. But, but it's better for you because maybe we will not be able to give your child back. Yeah, and you experiencing this interrogation from FSB, from special services, Russian special services, for hours. And then they could decide to send you to lie detection. Oh, we, we don't believe you. Yeah, it's better uh, you should go to a lie detection because maybe you work for, um, for Ukrainian special services. It's, it's, we have to be sure. And it could uh, be 10 or 20 hours long. Sometimes it's a day long. And for six or more hours of interrogation. And that group of ladies, it was more than 10 uh, relatives, were interrogated 13 hours. And we don't know how many hours this lady, this grandmother was interrogated, but after that, next day, she just died. Her heart stopped. Because uh, I don't know what I, I, I fa feel if somebody interrogate me 10 or more hours. And she died. And her granddaughter disappeared after that. 